Well, after getting all the way back here again, I found a way to actually interact with the sign. You have to interact with it from the front. Otherwise, it causes the game to crash. Just gotta love that, right? And yeah, I found this weird piece of paper over here. Hmm, so what does this thing say, anyway? Is it the story of what happened here? Dear friends, whoever you may be reading this, by the time you read this, we shall all be long for this world. Don't you mean long gone? I am here for embarrassed that our once lovely village be seen in a state like this. If only it weren't for those flashing lights and roars from the heavens. We'd perhaps still be amongst the ranks of the surface world. Wait, do they mean the apocalypse? Yes, I'm sure that's what they mean by the roars from the heavens. And then he goes on to say... Many of our brethren perished in this incident. Even our beloved capital city could not withstand its terrible wrath. Some of us were able to flee south, but the rest of us, alas, remain imprisoned. If only we could join them. I do not fear for the future of the elven race. Perhaps not now, but in several centuries we may not have the numbers to live on. If only it wasn't for that terrible demon, we'd be able to join our brethren. I'll leave this as a final reminder of our previous world, past, and ourselves. If you're reading this, please defeat the demon that has imprisoned us for so long. And please spread the word of our race and culture. We were once proud, and still are, forevermore. Well, you wouldn't be an elf if you didn't have pride in your long, pointy ears, what can I say? Yeah, I think we could have already figured out that the place was destroyed. I mean, look at all the dead bodies. That was the reason why the elf population dwindled. So it was the apocalypse that sealed the fate of the elves. They managed to hold on for several more centuries, almost a thousand years. Huh. And now you're the last one, Mito. Yes. There's still some things I don't get. Why couldn't they leave with the rest of the elves? Why are they stuck in here? Hmm. Yeah, where is that demon? Oh, I seriously doubt that. It's either in here somewhere or it escaped. One or the other. <laughs> That's another good question now, isn't it? What was that? Mia, behind you! Ah... I think... this is it. Gravity. So that's the gravity orb? So it was here all along? So we were right. Eric must have somehow sealed the orb away here. He must have sealed the entrance after Drake had learned the gravity spells. Yeah, that's why the place was so well guarded. It was all Marinex doing. What do you expect? Drake's got no respect for anybody. Seriously. Yeah, we already know they're despicable. I mean, Granham kills people just because he can. Well, who else would take it? Well, now... Now the other question is worth is the um demon at That's it? That was almost too easy. Flowing through your veins, huh? Right, now all we have to do is use it on that damn portal. That should finish Drake off for good, and this whole thing will be all over. Is there somebody there? Ah, uh, the Demon Lord. Can't be defeated, huh? Damn, what the hell is that thing? Yeah, it has to be. <laughs> Damn, so that means no one has ever defeated this thing before, huh? Well, we can't let that stop us. Come, my lads. 
Onwards to glory! Gosh darn, can we just get to the fight? Would you just shut up, Demon Lord? Oh great, it's a demonic wall. Am I supposed to be impressed by a wall? Jeez. And it's spelling out the letters of our doom, eh? Nice. Great. Well, it looks like it takes a while for slower to activate. If it's able to activate all of those rings equipped. Because I definitely don't feel like it. Okay, Oracle Drink. Got it. I guess that was a bit excessive, but whatever. A Francisca? Well, it wasn't that tough. Yes. It's getting a strange feeling from it. I feel like it's a creature not of this world. What do you mean? It's a demon! Of course it wasn't from this world! Jeez. Most likely. Yep, for the sake of gravity. Yes, I believe so. As you said before, Drake must have known about Yagron, and therefore must have also known about the demon guarding the very depths of this place. It's a perfect place to hide away an orb he doesn't want anyone to find, no? <laughs> well, what do you expect? The guy's pure evil. <sighs> yeah, yeah. Can we just get out of here now? Tell me what its original purpose was. Anyway, I think it would be best if we hurry back to your airship now. Yes, after seeing what you people have been going through, I cannot stop and watch. Not sure how much help I'll be, but please allow me to join you in your fight. Uh, welcome aboard, Gunther. Can you please get me out of here fast? Yes, please warp us out. There's nothing else down here. You do, huh? Sure, no problem. We'll meet up with you outside. Holy, she doesn't die, you know? Great, we're not even all the way out. <sighs> yeah, I hope so too. Look how they have warped us further out. I still have to walk through most of this. I mean, I got a free recharge, but having to walk through all this territory again is gonna suck. Unless all the enemies are gone. Then it'll be easier. Because I'm really running out of patience for fighting all the trash mobs that pop up. Gosh darn it. I mean, at least I can beat these ones to death, but still, it's the principle of the thing, you know? I'm just tired of seeing enemies over and over and over again. Ugh. All takes care of that, alright. At least I know the way out like, by heart, basically, so getting out of here shouldn't take too long if I don't get stopped every five seconds by a random encounter. <sighs> Jeez, just kill it. Great, we're gonna have to take a free hit. You can't silence Mia. She's unsilenceable. I mean, she's the only one wearing a ribbon, like... I would be wearing if I wasn't always more worried about having speed advantage against the, um, bosses. Because the only bosses that really screw with that plan are in the arena. <laughs> Oddly enough. It's kind of surreal to me. Come on, just a little bit more. And it's all over. 
Well, now. Seriously? Murdoch's back. Again? Seriously, why do we keep running into this guy? Not quite, huh? Realize? It's such a shame that an element like that is in such inexperienced hands. What's it to you, anyway? You won't be laughing once we've destroyed your Marinek for good. As I said, I'm not part of Marinek. What they do... doesn't really concern me. It's all for my own... amusement. From here, it looks to us like you're helping Marinek. I don't understand what you're talking about. Just who exactly are you? What I am is something that cannot be comprehended by the people of this world. However, by your simple brains, I suppose a mercenary will have to suffice for now. Although I'm not motivated by power nor money, but something else. And what would that be? Entertainment? Can I just kill you, or will you move aside, man? Take your pick. Truth once and for all, huh? Unknown, yet, you know, we've been building spells from it for like the last, what, 10 plus episodes? Ugh. Just, just go away. Got that right. Indeed, let's go and speak with Miss Rose on the airship. It's time to try out our new element, which isn't new. Gosh darn it. Like, see, we have a more powerful version of it. Ugh. I think picking up the golden orb in there taught me another spell. I just don't know which one. Ugh. Okay, let's just go this way. And get out of here. Ugh. Man, it's just a long game. Something like it done by the time, you know, we got to night. Why? Why not just keep it then? Why are you burying it in the middle of the forest? It's a decision that does nothing. And accomplishes nothing. So, why do it? Ugh, that one just baffles me for as a decision. Ugh. Well, that'll do for this episode. Next time, you know, we can hopefully tie things up by going into the portal. But I'm guessing that's going to get dragged out into several episodes as well, because this game loves to make all the dungeons at the end game really freaking long. Until next time, then. See ya.